الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم I'm sorry? Thank you very much. I appreciate your time, don't worry. So, you're going to go or you know? All right. So, we believe, what is the, we want to explain what the definition of a Muslim. Anybody who submits their will to their creator is a Muslim, all right? Aslama, the word Muslim linguistically comes from Aslama. So we believe that Jesus, he gave his will to his creator. He did the work of his creator. He was sent by God, as we find in some biblical verses as well. So he was a Muslim, just like Abraham and Moses and others were Muslim. They did the work of their creator. So everybody who submits themselves to the will of their creator is a Muslim by definition. Yeah, you're a Muslim. Excellent. Great. So do you have a Quran? Oh, there you go. It's a free gift for you today. Amazing. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. All right. You from San Diego? No. You live in LA. LA? Oh, it's close. Not too far. All right. What do you know about Islam so far? Other than Jesus being a Muslim? Not much, honestly. Excellent. So we have a belief in Islam of one great creator that created everything that's ever living. That's not a man, that's not a woman, it's not a monkey. We don't give it any shape. We don't say that it was born or anything like that. A creator that's always been there, that will always be there. The one that sent all the prophets. We love all the prophets. We love Moses, we love Abraham, we love Jesus, we love Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon them. We believe all of them brought the same message. That's what we call the One Message Foundation. But people corrupted the message. Right. As you know, I mean the Gospels, the... Uh, what's your message? Hare Krishnas. Hare Krishnas, okay. So what is the core, I mean, I'm asking it's similar sincere. similar to what you're saying. Okay, excellent, excellent. So when you submit your will, to do what the Creator asks you to do, call people toward the oneness of God, not to worship other than God, not to kill, not to harm, not to harm your body, not to harm the environment. That is the same message all the prophets brought, right? Yeah. But people over time for political or whatever reason, they change the message. So that original message, whoever submits to it, and it came in stages, right? Like for example, if me and you were alive and Abraham was here, I'm sure me and you would both follow him, right? And if we were alive and there was time of Jesus, we would follow Jesus. But this is the time of the last Prophet, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. So we follow him. And that is what God has ordained. Worship none but one God, right? And people know God through many names. We in Islam don't say just the word Allah. That is just one name, right? Ar-Rahman, the most merciful. Ar-Rahim, the specially merciful. Al-Ghafoor, the most forgiving, right? So many beautiful names. We have one hadith that says that there are 99 if you memorize. But we have other verses in the Quran that give more than that. In other languages, the Quran tells us that a prophet was sent to every nation. Right? It's not just for Israel, not just for the right for every nation. So that means in China, in India, in Africa, there were prophets sent. We know about 25 of their names in the Quran, but we know there's more than 120,000 prophets. So that means people like Buddha and Confucius could have been, we can't confirm and deny without evidence, but they could have been prophets as well, whose message was later corrupted and changed for political cause. Uh, as you see, uh, I mean, even if you look at Buddhism, right? Uh, I mean, if you look at the message of Buddhism, but then what's going on today in Burma with the killing of the Rohingya under the name of Buddhism, people have corrupted a message for political gain. But we believe in trying to follow the original message as it is, you know, without any as changes, is. as it is. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. So you got a Quran, read up. Uh, I have. I have it at home. Yeah, I've read it. Yeah, I've studied it back and forth. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, well, well, you have questions? Come back. We'll talk more. Thank you so much. We appreciate you coming out. So, um, on the Muslims. All right. Free information. Uh, there is the Quran itself. There's a good intro book. Uh, it's all free. I mean, uh, I like to build some bridges. Some, Open up some dialogue for understanding. Do you know much about Islam already? Not really, but yeah. I'm very curious. Excellent. Yes. So let me just give you the brief uh, of the belief, in one minute kind of a thing. So we believe, huh? So it's like the elevator pitch for us. There you go, right? <laughs> uh, it's the YouTube world today, so you got to do shorts, right? So, um, we believe in one great creator, right? We don't believe that creator has any kids. We don't believe that creator has any partners. It's not like, you know, people, you know, fighting over the universe. That one great creator controls everything, knows everything, created the whole universe, created me and you, loves us, wants good for us, right? So he guides us, right? You sometimes feel it in your heart, like you know right from wrong. 
This will be called fitrah, like your natural state, right? And that one creator created us with purpose. Like this world is with a purpose. And the purpose of this life is for us to recognize Him and worship Him. Not just worship Him like pray, but live our life in the way that He wants us to live. Like for example, as Muslims, we don't drink alcohol. Not because it's going to harm the Creator, but because we see the harm of it that it comes in society, right? We don't kill, we don't steal. These are laws for our own benefit, right? So when we worship the Creator in our daily life, we get a good life in this life, a clean society, and we also make it pass this test for the hereafter. That's the real life, right? This life is only a temporary stage, right? Like think about it, before here, you were in the womb of the mother. Right? That was a different life, totally different existence. Before that, you were... Great. Right, they went, right? It didn't get bothered by anybody, yeah. right? Yeah, for self. But but that's the thing. Nine months, that's how that life is, right? You gotta keep moving, right? You move into this life, it's also temporary, right? This life, you got whatever how many year, years you live, no matter what, everybody nobody's gonna make it out of here alive. Yeah. Right? With these writers? So, yeah. yeah, with these writers. I like this guy. They're cool. So here this life ends, the next life begins. That's the everlasting life, right? So we know as people that the Creator sent us messengers, right? Like we believe in Moses and Abraham and Jesus and Muhammad, peace and blessing. We love all of them. Yeah. We, even when we say their name, we say peace be upon them. You never see a Muslim disrespect Jesus or disrespect Moses or Abraham or David because we believe the same God that sent them sent the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. That's Islam. All right, hey, that's all right. a good pitch. Tight, good. Tight, on it. Right. I think you've done it before. I, think uh, I have, I have, okay, I have. Right. For many, many years. Right. <laughs> but alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah, you know that already. Right. You're good, man. Thank so if you, you got any more questions, here. come on back. I can do this with you. Did you want a bag? No. Oh. Okay. Okay. She's uh, oh. No hija, no madre, yeah. no padre. It's un dio. Just one. Just one. See. Si. Yeah. So Allah. Jehovah, whatever name people call, but yeah. Undio. Yeah. Yeah. Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim, merciful. And this time, many people are confused. Yes. Yeah. To the church. You know? And, uh, and uh, you, 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 uh, you know his devil too, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. Satan. Many speak of the devil. Whispering. You know? True. And, uh, and uh, people go in this time to say, I'm the God. Oh, that's crazy. Crazy. crazy, loco. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know. No, I have no. A nephew. A nephew says, "Almost, I'm God." <laughs> I tell you, you're crazy. You're crazy. God is only one. Only one. Allahu yeah, Akbar. You know, yeah. God is one above. Yes. He created all of us. Yes. He created yeah. Moses, Jesus, yeah. Muhammad. He, peace he, be upon he them. The creation. See. Yeah, yeah, I know. And I we know. are the creation. Yes. Right? Yes. So we must worship Undio. Yeah. You're Muslim? How many years you 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 school for uh, Islam? Uh many years, yeah. Maybe at the yeah. Uh no no, maybe not that much. Uh school school, maybe about seven, eight years. Yeah, that's cool. yeah but then also studying like outside of school yeah. for maybe ten oh, yeah. fifteen years, yeah. Yeah. Maybe end? Yeah. So you you believe Undios, huh? Oh yes. Okay, yes, good. You believe in Prophetas? Yeah. Yes. Moses, Moses Abraham, 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 Jesus, yeah, Muhammad, Isaac, Isaac and, and the uh, last of them, Muhammad. You know Muhammad? You believe in Muhammad? That's it. You're Muslim. All right. Think about it. Have a good one. Sounds a lot. You doing, bro? Sounds like you skateboarding out here, huh? Nice. All free. This is awesome. Good beginning book. You guys, uh, you guys know much about Islam already, or no, no, I nothing? Know. I'm just interested. Nice. Since I passed by, I was interested. Yeah, no, it's all free. Please feel free. Okay. So Islam, let me just tell you uh, real quick the belief, right? In Islam, we have a core belief. There's only one Creator, right? That Creator is all powerful, all knowing. There's only one. He doesn't have any kids, doesn't have any roommates, doesn't have a wife, doesn't have baby mamas, none of that stuff. Those are all human relations. God is above all of that, right? That God created us with a purpose. And the purpose of our creation is to recognize Him and worship Him, right? In order to facilitate that out of His mercy, He sent us prophets like Adam and Abraham and Moses and Jesus and Muhammad. Peace be upon all of them. We love them all. We know them all. And we, even when I say the name Jesus, I say peace be upon Him. That's how much we respect Him. But we don't say He's God. 
He is a prophet of God, as the prophet Muhammad and Abraham, Moses, may Allah have peace and blessings upon all of them. That's the Muslim belief. How do you like it? Yeah. <laughs> Makes sense, right? Thank you. Thank you. You get questions? Yeah. 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 One God, exactly. You can't be three and one, right? Doesn't make sense, right? Like people say Jesus was God, right? But if Jesus is God, then how? who did he worship? You don't worship yourself, right? <laughs> like if you see some dude talking to himself, you're going to be like, he's off a little bit, right? <laughs> right? But if you see somebody talking to somebody else, like, like if I need help and I call out, I'm like, hey, yo, help me out, bro. That means I need your help. You're somebody, I'm somebody, I'm, bro. But Jesus, he called out to God. So he's not God, he's calling out to God. Make sense? Yeah. So that's Islam. <laughs> Have a good one, bro. If you get questions, come on back. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I was trying to get. إذا أعجبك الفيديو لا تنسى الإعجاب والتعليق ولكي يصلك كل جديد اشترك الآن